I'm very happy that we have the opportunity to organize such important uh, event. Um, it's the first step on the implementation of the strategic plan 2025, which is amazing job for the Egyptian government. There is no lack of uh, talent uh, in, in the Egypt context, however, um, coordination is critical uh, and that, that needs to happen at the local uh, level and at the operational uh, management level uh, within the government administrations. There needs to be more horizontal uh, coordination as well as uh, vertical coordination. It's a great pleasure to participate in such workshop for smart cities in Egypt and uh, hope for more collaboration. I see um, great potential, uh, but uh, a number of things has been taken into account in order to make it successful. Uh, number one is to integrate urban planning with the governance and with the finance that comes attached. So we need a combination in the local governments, municipalities, uh, ministries of um, uh, different uh, disciplines uh, from urban planners to economists to lawyers, um, sociologists, all kinds of expertise uh, in order to tackle uh, the issue for cities. Uh, it's always exciting to participate in knowledge exchange events and I really hope that the recommendations uh, discussed in this workshop are used to transform our cities into smart ones. There are a number of questions and challenges around this. Of course, the cost itself of installing technology, the ability to access technology. This usually involves a complicated equation around managing public finance and engaging in public-private partnerships where you're, you're looking at the relative benefits and costs of different solutions. Other challenges that are very difficult to overcome in many situations particularly involve coordination. The greatest benefits in smart city applications come when you connect, connect data from different services and from different measurements.